Former El Paso Diablos owner Jim Paul's name is synonymous with local baseball, but he's also well known for his contributions to minor league baseball as a whole. And as ABC 7's Darren Hunt tells us, that's resulted in a recent nomination to Baseball Reliquary, Reliquary excuse me, Shrine of Eternals. Rick, the Baseball Reliquary is a Southern California-based organization that's dedicated to fostering appreciation of American art and culture through baseball history. Now, the Shrine of Eternals is similar to the Baseball Hall of Fame, except that it differs philosophically in that statistical accomplishment is not a criteria. It would mean that baseball people are acknowledging your contribution to the game. Jim Paul reacted to recent news that he is one of 12 new nominees for the Baseball Reliquary's Shrine of Eternals. To be uh, acknowledged uh, for my contributions and that of my staff and the city of El Paso, it would, be, it would be a wonderful thing. Paul's nomination includes a short bio. It reads, revered as the man who saved baseball in El Paso, Texas, and since recognized as an innovative genius responsible for re-energizing minor league franchises nationwide. Among those already inducted into the baseball reliquary's shrine of eternals is one-handed pitcher Jim Abbott, Pete Rose, and Fernando Valenzuela, who are not members of the Baseball Hall of Fame, and the famous chicken, Ted Giannolis, who was inducted in costume in 2000. Uh, each of one of us, in our own ways, I guess uh, we're, we're pioneers. Giannolis nominated Paul for induction into this year's Shrine of Eternals. People in minor league baseball wanted to see what we're doing. Why are we filling the stands? The Diablos' popularity in the minors led to Paul's creation of the annual El Paso Baseball Promotional Seminar. We started with four people, eight people, 12 people. The last one I did was 308 people. Paul said he started to realize his place in baseball history after El Paso's new ballpark was built. Anytime I went to a ball game, there was always three or four people that would walk up and say, you know, this wouldn't be possible without you. To vote for Paul's induction, you have to be a member of the Baseball Reliquary. However, you can join for just $25. You'll find a link to the Baseball Reliquary on our website at kvia.com. Darren Hunt, ABC 7.